Hello, everybody. Uh, my name is Jason. I'm Brandon. And I'm Jace. And we are Milltown Productions. Mm-hmm. That we are. We have a special video for you today. Yes. There are a couple of things that we're going to be doing that may or may not be exciting to you. <laughs> first, we're going to go through... Well, maybe not first. I don't know what order we're doing this in. <laughs> but today, uh, we have a tier list that we're going to be making from every character from Season 1. We're going to rank them. And also, I have been sheltered away from the comment sections on everything Game of Thrones. Jace and Jason um, have some questions that apparently you guys have for me from our uh, last episode that I, they're going to ask me, and I guess you're going to get my unfiltered, possibly edited answer. <laughs> <laughs> but before we get into doing any of that, I have to remind you guys that over 75% of you are not subscribed. So, before we actually get into the meat and potatoes of this episode, don't forget to hit that like button and go into the comments. Tell us what you think of our ranking, if you agree with Brandon's opinions on it. And uh, just hit that subscribe so you can come back and watch stuff with us every week. Let's get into the video! Question number one for Brandon. This was in the comments. Yeah. <laughs> this was asked by Dan Siegel. Question for Brandon. There are seven seasons left based on what you have seen so far. What do you think will happen over the coming seasons and how will it end? Oh, oh Lord. God. Um, <laughs> want a whole okay, so a seven season prediction. <laughs> I think that uh, Joffrey's reign is just beginning because of the display um, he put on with Ned's death. I think that that's something that um, George R. R. Martin may stretch out for a few seasons of just how he's rolling with an iron fist. Yeah, you know um, how much Joffrey is gonna evolve in these next few seasons as just a horrible like he's just gonna he's gonna hurt a lot of people, mm-hmm. and and I think that he's gonna try and um, force his will over like the kingdoms. A lot of the plots that I thought were gonna unravel completely just. You know, they ended themselves. Um, Call Drogo. Yeah. uh, I thought that he was going to end up crossing the the sea. Dead. He's just dead. (laughs) I thought that he was going to end up making it to to King's Landing, and uh, and there was going to be a three-way battle. Rob's arm, now they're, the way that they ended, um, they don't want to fight him anymore. They're headed back to the north, and they're just basically seceding. Uh, so I, I do think we're going to encounter a lot more of the wildlings um, north of the wall, more White Walkers. Um, I, people have talked about giants. I'm going to predict winter will come in season two, three. All right, Joffrey is going to remain king over <laughs> Westeros, and he's going to be evil. Okay, Daenerys, she's got dragons, bro. I mean, <laughs> she's going to be raising these dragons up. I think she's going to get what she wants for a little while, but she's not going to go after the king. I feel like she can't yet until her dragons are... Fully grown? Yeah, are grown. They're babies right now. Little drakes. Yeah. That's the best I can give you, really, honestly. Oh, okay. uh, the Starks are going to find a way to uh, to be powerful again. Okay. Okay. Um, he also put on a little thing in there. He said, roasting, sort of. Oh, no. Are the two of you up front brothers? Even twins? <laughs> Everyone thinks so, but we are not. We're not. I'm actually 21 years older. <laughs> six. She's six years older. Yeah, uh, yeah, six years older. Yeah, no. I'm, 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 I'm a little older than him. But every store that we ever go into together, we get asked if we're twins. Yep. Genevieve, she says, question for Brandon. How excited are you for season two? Which storyline are you most excited about? Ooh. You just listed off quite a few. Yeah, um, most excited for. I'm gonna go ahead and rank them. Um, John going north of the wall, okay. then Ari going to the wall, then Daenerys with her dragons, and then Joffrey because if, heck, Joffrey. <laughs> yeah. So there we go. And then yes, I'm extremely excited for season two. I'm excited to start diving into these storylines. Nila Luna says, can the fidget toys be named after Game of Thrones characters? Ooh. Oh, man. I feel like we... So where's the other two balls? 
<clears throat> well, if you watched our last <laughs> episode, you know that there are two other balls. Well, I don't want to say you know, but... <laughs> well, I mean... You should. As yeah. much as Jason plays we're, with them on the table. We're still going to name them, so remember them next time you see them. Yeah. yeah. They're like Rick I, on in this episode. Nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> I, I want that one to be Jamie. Because it's I yellow. I can see that. Because <laughs> yeah. it's golden haired. So because it's golden haired. So we've got our first Lannister. All right. Yeah. Oh, no. We should save that. <laughs> Don't name that one yet. I know exactly who to name that. What? No, there's it's future season. I'm not saying anything. <laughs> future season. I know. Who I think I know who you're thinking. <laughs> yeah. But, um, okay. So we've got Jamie and to oh, be announced. Yeah, TBD. <laughs> <laughs> to be TBA, determined. I guess, yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, we'll we'll figure the rest out later. The last question, because we really didn't have that many. This one's gonna be really hard to answer. Okay. Um, he even acknowledges that. Um, he says, "My question is." If you can pick one of the gods in Westeros or Essos <laughs> or some school of magic or magical tradition to oh, become Hogwarts. or, <laughs> or to back as a follower slash member, which would it be? Which would you choose and why? Obviously, you could you you can only choose from what you've encountered so far, but as the story progresses, that you learn a, more gods. So you've got the old gods and the yep. new gods that we know of right now. Yeah, I'm going old gods. Well, well, hang on. So you got the crying trees. Yep. Yeah. Um, but as the story progresses, that's an interesting and fresh, uh, not common way to track how you feel about the world as a viewer. Vida la muerta. We haven't really <laughs> seen much of, but we've seen the tree, and we have the new gods where we literally haven't seen anything from. Yeah, we don't know the traditions for that. Yeah, I'm going to say the old gods. I like the tree. And uh, yeah. as far as any school, uh, like I said before, um, Hogwarts. Hogwarts for sure. I don't know if we've learned any schools or anything yet, um, or houses that are for. So I don't think. Well, that, that's as far a, as houses go, you have uh, Gryffindor, <laughs> yeah. um, Slytherin, Hufflepuff, Ravenclaw. We'll have. Um, that'll be an ever evolving question, I guess, as you get introduced to more of the religions in the show, right? And what you think of them. So. What? So. Why is elite red and hate is green? Shouldn't that be reversed? I don't know. In color? I don't Expect know. Expect the unexpected. That's <laughs> Game seen, of Thrones. I've seen a lot of tier lists like that. I don't know why. But... Yeah, it does seem kind of weird. We'll go ahead and jump into this tier list really quickly. Okay. So, there's going to be a lot of names on here that we know and a lot of names that we don't remember. So, <laughs> I have a character list up and hopefully most of these names are here. We'll go ahead and start off. This is starting off very easy for a name to know. Ned Stark. That's right. Ned Stark. Where would you want to place Ned Stark? Um, um, I mean, this is a no-brainer. Yeah? All the way at the bottom. Damn. I know, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Put him up at Elite. Okay. Ned, I to me, Ned is a 10. Yeah? Yes. Ned is a 10. And then if we're not going on looks, um, <laughs> and we're just ba basing them off their character, he's a 10. What about his wife, Catelyn Stark? Okay, I... Oh, people are going to come for me for this. I don't know. I'm going to put Catelyn at average. Okay. And I would have put her at good because she... At, I think at times she's been not elite, but above good. In between good and elite. Okay. And then other times I've been kind of frustrated. Like... The way that she treats John, and I know a lot of people might come for me for this because they're like, oh, well, if you had a constant reminder. But that's not John's <clears throat> fault. Yeah. He, nope. he, he didn't yeah. wish to be born, you know, as a bastard, and yeah. his life has been harder already being a bastard. So I that had to knock him down to average for me. Okay. Now we'll we go on to the eldest son. Rob. Rob Stark. King of the North. The King of the North. Yep. Well, interim. <laughs> yeah. You know. What'd you say? <laughs> interim. He, yeah, he's the interim king of the north. Who knows if that's going to change by the time we get to season two, or <laughs> if that's even going to come to fruition. Let me see. Um, <clears throat> Rob, I, I'm going to put Rob elite. I'm going to put Rob elite. And oh. um, the reason why is because I think he's better than good, and I think he's he's on the lower end of elite he's trying to fill his dad's shoes i think he's the most like his dad of anyone other than maybe john okay but he's just too good of a person for me to knock him down to good okay then we have the eldest daughter sansa, sansa. all right 
Okay. Sansa, I'm going to go with <clears throat> average. Okay. Um, I have started to like Sansa, but she did... I've said this earlier uh, in the season. If you've watched all of our episodes, then I, you, you know my thoughts on Sansa when, um, when Joffrey uh, comes and starts picking on Ari and the butcher's boy. Sansa sticks up for Joffrey, which it makes sense because she's to uh, marry him. However, I didn't like it. <laughs> and now I'm starting to like her more, so I would have put her at bed right there because she almost got Ari's dire wolf deaded yeah so then yep. she so got she her got own her, yeah. yeah lady ended up getting yeah. <laughs> did not care until it was her own dog yep, yep exactly and so that's <clears throat> why i would have had her at bad but she's barely redeemed herself to average for me Avarage. <clears throat> so we'll go on to the middle one of the middle children Arya Ari. stark yep okay so um uh, this one is probably I almost said this is the easiest one, but obviously Ned <laughs> was the easiest one possible. All right, I'm going to put her at elite okay. just because oh. she is, she's kind of naive in that she's just ready to take on the, everybody, even though she doesn't have the ability to yet, but she's got the, she's got the heart of yeah. Ned. You know what I mean? Like she, just like uh, I said about Rob, she's ready to go um, <clears throat> to bat for her family. And uh, she, I think, is uh, uh, she has one of the best characters. Yeah. I think that's the stark difference between her and Sansa. <laughs> I see what you did there. <laughs> um, um, so we have Bran. That's right. Okay. Bran, um, we share a name. <laughs> yeah. So there's always that. Also, I got a broke neck. He's paralyzed. <laughs> so um, thankfully, I am not. But... I see a lot of myself in Bran. He's oh. he's young, he's naive, <laughs> um, he's kind of weak, like I was when I was oh little. Um, let's. I would put Bran at good. Okay. Uh, Rickon Stark, the youngest of the children. I mean, come on. Is there anything I can really base his rating you off know of? Nothing about Rickon, other right. than the time he was in. The like catacombs of right. Winterfell and was and like, oh, I thought I saw Dad down here. He looks like every other little kid that you see in any suburb ever <laughs> that you just pass by. You know, he's he's running through the neighborhood in people's <laughs> yards. Um, I'm yeah. gonna put him at average just because I have nothing to go on. Yeah, Jon Snow. Come on, uh, <laughs> I know elite, bro. It, yeah. It's like that one. You can't even question. Yeah. yeah, I don't even think you have to justify it. No, he shows up to the wall. He's the best. Um, he's the best swords swordsman. Why can't? Yeah. Swordsman. I mean, but he's also a leader. Yeah, he's a leader at heart, and he takes it. Listen, he also has a temper, but understandably so. He's getting screwed over at the wall by <clears throat> Alistair. But what, what? Bam. But what, boom. Yeah, Alistair. But what we've seen is that he does have the ability to be talked down. Yes, exactly. And talked sense. It's not into. a blind rage. Yeah. Um, and again, if he could protect his family, he would. He he tried to leave the wall, yeah. and he had a dilemma um, of his own honor. Of is it more honorable to defend my family or is it more honorable to stay at the wall and not abandon my oath? And that's that's a hard decision to make. Yeah. And uh, it was good that he had his friends around to um, to kind of pull him back to the wall because there, realistically there's nothing really he could have done if he would have left. Yeah. He's just awesome. Next we have Theon Greyjoy. Oh, Theon. Okay. I'm going to put him at good because okay. I really like Theon. But I feel like the way he treats the non-slave that um, attacks Bran in the woods with the others. But they make a, it a point to say she's not a slave. Mm -hmm. um, well, now, his first interaction with her was not very good. Exactly. Whenever... That's yeah. why I'm not going to put him at elite. Yeah. That encounter right there. Um, but everything else, I mean, honestly, I really like Theon. All right, we have Robert Baratheon. King Robert. Come here, let me smell it. Tits. <laughs> Uh, but it smells like blackberry jam. <laughs> oh no! Where would King Robert go? Um, oh man, I really he's like. Fun. Yeah, he's he's really fun. <laughs> he's like he's like, please give him a good ranking. <laughs> oh no no no! He's, I like him. He's going. He's going good. 
good. Okay. Yeah. Um, and that won't change. <laughs> yeah. For obvious reasons. <laughs> <laughs> he was kind of oblivious to the attacks around him. Mm -hmm. um, so mm -hmm. I have to knock him down one because he of all people should know that <laughs> Joffrey's not his. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, we have his not so much biological son, <laughs> yeah. Joffrey Baratheon. Where would you like to put him? Wow, it's the first one. Mm. Joffrey needs to die. We 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 know what that says. Yeah, and you guys know what that says. Yeah, you just heard it. Um, I don't really think you have to explain why Joffrey needs to die. Joffrey's yeah. a piece of shit. Joffrey's Joffrey, you know. Yeah, that's that goes without saying. Yeah, but now we have Marcella. Yep, which is Joffrey's sister. Oh, and uh -huh. I'm pretty sure it's a, a similar situation to Tom, um, Rickon. We haven't. Well, we've seen her, I think, maybe once or twice. Yeah, Marcella, uh, Marcella. It's like Marcella or something like that. Yeah. Okay. Marcella. <clears throat> I have had a, an epiphany. epiphany. All of these kids, yeah, have blonde hair. Yeah. Not just Joffrey. So yeah. for that, just because she is a product of inbreeding. Oh, no. I'm going to put her at bad. Damn. Guilty by association. Well, do you want to do the same thing with Tommen? That is the youngest Lannister child, He I also has blonde hair, does he not? Yeah. It looks He's like a going dark blonde. Bed. And you don't even... We, I think yeah, you but might it's not have black. seen him once. Like, so yeah. we'll put him there. Now, Cersei Lannister. Did I say it right? Yes, yes you, you did. did. Cersei. Cersei. Cirque du Soleil? Cirque du Soleil? Cirque du Soleil. Cirque du Soleil. <laughs> we work with a child. <laughs> Slurp. Don't. She's... Where would you put her? Oh, you know, huh, this one might actually be the easiest one yet. Oh. Uh, needs to die. <laughs> okay. <laughs> needs to die. Because Cersei needs to die. I feel like that, uh, I don't even need an explanation for that one. Okay. Jamie now. Lannister. Jamie <laughs> Uh, gonna this is going to surprise everyone. Okay. <clears throat> I hate Jamie, <laughs> yeah. but I'm going to put Jamie at good. Oh. oh. Wow. Yeah. So it's like a love to hate but, situation. Yeah, I hate how evil Jamie is, but I've got to be honest. Jamie's a badass. <laughs> yeah. He pisses me off, but I can't let that affect... I'm gonna. I'm using these rankings right not as how much I enjoy the person, but the per their character themselves. Yeah. He's just too good. He is elite at what he does, and I hate him. So I'm bringing him down to the upper side of good. Makes sense. Makes sense. Tyrion Lannister. Listen here, Tyrion. Doesn't need to be said. I'm continuing this staircase that we've got going on right here. <laughs> <laughs> of course he's elite. Of course. Like. Uh, he can outdrink anyone on this list so far, even Robert. <laughs> <laughs> they would have a fun night together. Yes, 100%. they would. They would be friends, honestly. Yeah. The way that they both talk, I think that they would be really good buddies. If there wasn't like the, the marital issues within the family, and they just like met at a bar. <laughs> right. That would be the craziest shit to see. Oh, like. I know. Tywin Lannister. Okay, listen here, Tywin. Head Lannister. You are evil, and honestly, I just don't like you. No. <laughs> I don't know enough about how great you are at what you do to put you up there with uh, Jamie. so I'm going to put you at hate because it's the only thing I have to go off of. And the way that you treat Tyrion, who has been nothing but good this this far, um, yeah, you're going to he hate. Learned, he learned about that story of what he did to... His oh, yeah. fake wife. That's right. That was terrible. Tysha. We're going to go to Robert's brother. Oh, I, let me guess this one. <laughs> Only because the I... The name? Yeah. Okay. Renly. Renly. Renly Baratheon. Renly Baratheon. I'm going to put Renly at average. Okay. I don't... We have not seen... I, please don't come for me in the comments. If you do, again, <laughs> I can't see them. I don't believe that we have seen Stannis... Um, no, his older haven't. brother. Mm -hmm. And Stannis really um, 
was heir to the throne. He was next in line, and I didn't like the way that Renly, again, I don't know Stannis, so I don't know what kind of person he is, but the way that Renly handled the situation and wanted to take the power for himself and was kind of cutthroat in that way, mm -hmm. I have to put him at average. Next in line? Varys. The Varys. spider. The spider. The um, eunuch. Yeah, listen, Varys at times entertains me, Yeah, but at times... He's really creepy. Yeah. <laughs> and he's, I never know which Varus I'm going to get. <laughs> he's creepy, but he's also a very confusing character. Yeah, he's <laughs> so very smart. Their trade is information. Yeah, yeah exactly. So, uh, I mean, I've throughout this season, uh, him and our next person, <laughs> I, I'll guess his name whenever we get to it, um, have... Quite a few um, interactions. Yeah, um, I love their interactions. Oh yeah, mm -hmm. and like you said, their their business is information. They mm -hmm. know everything that goes on. So I got to give him credit. He's good at what he does. He's got ears and eyes everywhere. But also, he's like your creepy uncle <laughs> that like puts his hand on your lower back at the God. you know at family he looks gatherings. Like, he looks like Uncle Fester. <laughs> and for that reason, I'm gonna put him. At average. Okay. Little finger. Oh, yeah. You Little finger. You should have said, I'm going to put him and his gash <laughs> oh, <at> average. Okay. <laughs> well, I don't know if he's got a gash or not. He, he just said he could possibly have a gash. He said, he said uh, a, a man from a strange land, feared by, all. oh, am I? Do you stay up at night fearing my gash? <laughs> That's right. <clears throat> okay. I'm little finger. Put little finger. Little finger, very conniving. He's smart. <laughs> yeah. He's cutthroat. He is evil at times. Littlefinger is playing for one person and one person only. Littlefinger. Littlefinger, I think, is similar to Varys, um, but he's look, looking out for numero uno, and that's himself. Yeah. I am going to put Littlefinger... Oh, you guys are going to hate me for this. Good, because he's extra entertaining. <laughs> Next, we have a, a series of maesters. Yep. Sorry. Is, do you have tea? Yes. All right, continue. Uh, Meister. Did it start with a G? Mm -mm. Oh, Pycelle. Pycelle. Meister Pycelle. He's so, the one that fakes being old. Yes, dude. I mean, That's my old, favorite but... scene with him in it. Dude. Before that, every single scene, I have hated him. Yeah. He's always like, whatever is the most honorable thing, he just happens to be <laughs> on the opposite side of that yeah. opinion. Listen, that scene was not enough for me to like him. Um, I'm going to put him at bad. Okay. My, mm, yeah, Meister Picel is bad. We've got ourselves another Meister here, or Maester, whichever you want to say. Yeah. I'm going to go with Meister. Okay. So, mm. this, this one is, starts with a G. This is, nope. This, is the, <laughs> this is the Meister who, Stunk. Meister at uh, Winterfell. Oh. Lunas? Mm-mm. Loom. M? Mm-mm. Okay, hold on. Lewin. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Lewin. Lewin, okay. <laughs> okay. Meister, Meister Lewin. All right, well, I've, I butchered that one. Meister Lewin of Winterfell. Yes. Got it. He's okay. always, like, kind of teaching Bran some things. when. They're yeah. Like... I actually, I enjoy him. I'm going to put him good. Okay. The last Meister we have on here, I believe. Yes. He's the one at the wall. Yeah. He's the, the Targaryen. Mm-hmm. He's Meister... What the f Eamon. If anyone has claim to the throne right now, it's Eamon. Yeah, technically. Well, I mean... And not anymore, actually. He can't hold any positions because he's at the wall. Now that he took his vow, he gave it up. Yeah. yeah. Oh, damn. I'm putting him at good. Okay. I like him hey. a lot. Uh, I can't wait to see more of him, and I hope he has a bigger role. Lord Commander Mormont. That's Jorah's dad. Yeah, Jor. Jorel. <laughs> um... Let's see. He's Clark Kent's dad. Yeah. I'm going to put him at elite. Oh. I enjoy him, and he's he's a badass. So the next one, Sir Alistair Thorne. Well, um, Alistair is going to go to needs to die. <laughs> All right. Do you want to know <laughs> why? <laughs> he's a f freaking prick. Samuel Tarly. Listen, Samwise Gamgee... Uh, <laughs> Samuel Tarly, I think, is uh, good. Okay. Because for obvious reasons, he's not elite, but he's better than average. True. He's a good guy. So we've got 
uh, I'm pretty I'm pretty sure her name was Osha. Yeah, Osha. Um, aka Nymphadora Tonks. Yep. Uh, Osha Nymphadora. I'm gonna put. I actually enjoy Osha her. Nymphadora. I'm gonna put her at good. <laughs> okay. Okay. That's right. I like her too. Hodor. Oh, Hodor. that's Hodor. Hodor. I can't even see the picture from here, bro. He looks like the dad from Drake and Josh. <laughs> I am. Um, listen. Hodor. <laughs> I know what I said earlier. I'm not ranking them off of liking. <laughs> for the most part. For the most part. Hodor's elite. Hodor is elite. And okay. I feel like everyone I won't likes. get a lot of backlash for that one. Nah. Everyone likes Hodor. Bingen. Bingen stock. <laughs> Uncle Bingen. We saw him like twice. Yeah, dude. Mm-hmm. And then he's just been missing ever since his horse came back by itself. Empty. Yeah. Yep. Um, I am so, putting him at elite. Oh, okay. <laughs> because... I've seen him a few times, and I liked him. And then also, everyone has said he's like the best thing that ever happened to the wall. So Now, these guys, I don't remember their names. But they're friends of Jon Snow. Yes, and so Samwell. I am going to put both of his friends at good. Okay. <laughs> okay. So, this guy. Good. Uh, Sir Roderick. Roderick Castle. Oh, Roderick Castle is good. Good. We've got the mountain. All right. Well, I mean, this one's hard. <laughs> uh, so far, bad, but so elite. Wait. So what? where where do you want to put him? I'm gonna put him at elite. Damn. He killed a horse. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But everything a, we've heard about him, he's a bad dude. We heard him, but about, he's a bad dude. <laughs> yeah, we heard him with one swing of his sword cut a man in half. Yeah. And I mean, dude, he, I mean, he about to horse his head off in yeah. one swoop, man. Yeah. Um, we've got the hound. Yeah, the hound. I'm also going elite. I mean, <laughs> it's in their blood. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, we've got Sir Loris, the Knight of Ooh. Flowers. Okay, Sir Loris. I'm going to go good. Okay. That was Rinley's lover. Yep. I'm going to go good. Okay. Daenerys. <laughs> Daenerys Targaryen. I mean, Daenerys is elite. Hey. I I like her. Um, she mm. doesn't take any crap from anybody. Mm-hmm. And I mean, she's got dragons. <laughs> True. I mean, <laughs> or she got some can drinks. You say? Yeah. Oh, Jora. Jora Mormont. Okay, Jora. Damn, elite's kind of growing. I'm going elite, dog. I mean, <laughs> it's your team list. Like, do what you want. Yep. yep. That's true. Now we've got all the doggies. Okay, is that brands? I it's don't first. know. Oh, yes, it is. That's Whoa. Brands right here. This oh, that's is, Brands? Okay. That's Summer. Yep. That's so, Shaggy Dog Ghost. That's um, got to be Ari. Lady. Lady. Yeah, Lady's Lady. right there with Sansa. That's Nymeria. That's Nymeria. Okay, so this and is Rod. Wind. Yeah, Grey Wind is, um, I almost said Roderick. <laughs> um, Rob's. Yeah, Rob's. Um, <laughs> y'all are going to, I feel like. All of them are elite. I was about to say, like, <laughs> they're how could you elite. not? They're all good puppies. Well, now we have Braun. Oh, bro, Braun, man. Okay, listen. <laughs> There's a lot of elite people in this show, guys. Yeah. There's a lot of people that I hate, but there's a lot but of people that are elite. The thing is that we're about to thin it out a little bit. Yeah. Coming up, so well, who, who knows? Maybe I like them all, bro. Braun, elite. Oh, elite okay. for sure. Shay. Shay. Shay the whole. Um, I'm Shay the funny whore. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> below average. Okay, so just average? Yeah. Okay. Well, below average is bad. <laughs> I uh, cannot remember this particular whore's name. Oh, um, oh yeah. she is the greatest whore that ever lived, basically. She's the one say. that Theon is like in love with. <laughs> Let me see it. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Um, Let me see if her name is on here. Average. Liza. Lysa Aaron. Oh, bro. Catelyn's sister who breastfeeds oh. her 12 year old. Let's see here. <laughs> um, do I go. <laughs> it's, not that, it's not that deep. Uh, needs to die. <laughs> Damn. Just fucking God. straight through the veil. <laughs> that, that moon door. Yup. Like, <clears throat> make mommy fly. Well, now we've That's got right. her little shit, Robin. Oh, Robin. Yeah. Is about fly- him. Is bro. he flying with mommy? Oh, bro. He's flying right after. <laughs> Needs to die. Well, he always said, I want to see him fly. Like, You're going to see your mommy fly. That's right. And then 
Guess you're what? gonna fly. You're gonna fly. You get to see mommy fly for almost the entire time she's flying. <laughs> yeah. She won't be that far out of you. And then right before you get to see what's about to happen to you. Yep. Oh. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. We've got Walder Frey Filch. Okay. <laughs> I hate him, but I love to hate him. <laughs> I'm going good. Walder Frey is in good. Yep. He's right. Filch, guys. I mean, yeah. come on. Is he a bad person? We don't know. He's a, he's got some weird shit going on with all yeah, the daughters. He's got. I was about to say. I mean, he's he's kind of a bad person. <laughs> yeah, but he's entertaining. Yeah, so he's good. Now we've got Barristan Selmy, who Ned says is like the greatest person, the greatest fighter yeah. he's ever seen. When he goes to um, listen, I'm going to give Barrister Barristan Barristan Barrister. Mm. <laughs> I mixed Baylor with Barristan. <laughs> Uh, when he goes, listen, I'm going to go good. Because I don't know enough about him to make him elite with everyone else. Yeah. Now, this guy you might not recognize. Wait, I've seen him before. Yeah, his name is uh, Illin Payne. That is Illin the, Payne. Bro, that is name. the man that chopped off Ned's head. Yeah. Um, the executioner. Illin... He's got a pretty na- or he's got a pretty cool name. <laughs> yeah. He's got a pretty name. <laughs> I'll say, wait, I mean, what? Ilan Payne is a cool ass name. Yeah, it is, man. Uh, Which kind of spares him from needing to die <laughs> to me, oh, bro. Well, also, think about it. He's doing, he's just his, doing his job. Yeah. I'm not giving him a pardon. I'm just showing some mercy. I'm putting them at hate. Okay. I hate him for that reason, but I don't think he deserves to die yeah. for doing it. I think he was just doing his job, but screw him because I don't like that. I mean, I, I recognize him, but I can't think of his name right now. Hang on. That's, oh, yeah, that's the guy who got his finger bitten off. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I was like, oh, the, you know, this will happen before the day that this family follows an order from a fucking... Yeah. Yeah. And then... <laughs> so we know who he is. We just can't remember the name. So he's gotten better. Contestant number one, where are we putting him? <laughs> well, listen, I like him. I'm going to be I, honest. He got his finger ripped off, and... It didn't really even phase him. He He's laughed. He said, your mate is bloody tough. <laughs> yeah. So, I got to give him good. Okay. He's good. Lancel uh, Lannister. Need, just, he needs to die. Okay. I, just, I don't like the way he looks. <laughs> <laughs> so, now we have Gendry. That would be Robert Baratheon's bastard son. Yeah. Mm. He's really good at what he does. Being a blacksmith. He's and I like, like him so far. Helmet. I'm going to make him... Elite. Oh, Damn. I saw the I, I saw the helmets he made. Yeah. He also defended Arya. Yeah. He, yes, he, he did. <laughs> oh <right>. no! <laughs> so this guy, fat boy, his name is Hot Pie. <laughs> um, <laughs> <laughs> it reminds me of Holes. Yeah. Barf bag. I don't remember. Th- we're gonna call him Barf bag. <laughs> <laughs> yes, and this is armpit. Why actually, are they even on here? <laughs> actually, he looks more like it might be zigzag. Zigzag. So we're going to call him Zigzag. So Zigzag and... Hot Pie. Or Armpit. Yeah, I'm going to call him Armpit. Even though... Yep. So, let's see. <clears throat> armpit uh, needs to die. <laughs> oh, my God. And Arya said, <laughs> Arya said, I like killing fat boys. That's right. And honestly, it would have been a pretty <laughs> cool scene if she did. And then Zigzag. Zigzag. Guess what, guys? <laughs> Guess where he needs to go? Kill the children. I, I hate him. But he needs to die! <laughs> Where's Anakin when you need him? Oh, God. Now we've got Sir Yorin. He is from the wall. He's actually the one that is taking Arya to the wall right now. Yeah, he's the recruiter. Yeah. That's right. I I, mean, I don't know enough about him, but guess what? <laughs> he needs to die! Elite! <laughs> he saved Arya. Yeah, bro, and that deserves elite. All right, we've got the leader of the... Like storm crows or whatever. Oh, bro, fuck. Shaga. <laughs> yeah, Shaga. Shaga likes knives. <laughs> Shaga likes daggers. <laughs> I mean, bro, is Elite down to three rows now? Do we have it it's at three? Like, it's something like that. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. You He's going in Elite. Complain to them for making so many Elite characters. I mean, what, what's funny is that Shaga technically is a bad dude <laughs> yeah he dude just, yeah. he kills people in the woods for no reason yeah. <laughs> but, but he's, he's so, so good at it I, I, yes i do like shaga but it's funny that we like him because he technically is still a bad guy yeah, yeah that's right <laughs> so now we've got sirio farrell oh man the first sword of bravos 
I will be mad at you if you don't. I, you're sort of right. <laughs> needs to die, I, honestly. <laughs> Just kidding. I'm not a serial killer. <laughs> uh, he's elite. That was oh my good. God. <laughs> All right, so this is like the nanny of the Winterfell house. Yeah, she's good. Well, we've got Jory. Is that Jory? Jory. It's hard to see him. I'm pretty sure it's Jory. Uh, got stabbed in the eye by Jamie Lannister. Um... Oh, wait, is that his oh. sword in the eye right there? Yeah. Oh, so that is Jory. Okay, I mean, I got to put him at good because we didn't get enough of him. I kind of want to put him in elite, but he's good. Okay. What the fuck is that? It looks like a silo of corn from what here. Oh, that? oh, that's 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 uh that's Daenerys' brother with the golden the golden crown. Oh. oh I it's was Viserys. I literally Viserys. could not tell what I was looking at. I literally I thought it was a I swear I Really yeah. thought that was a silo of corn. I thought it was yeah. like a strange mural. With I didn't know what was going on, but yeah. So Viserys. I mean, Viserys. it's already come to fruition, but needs to die, bro. Hey. I, I mean, over and over again. I'd watch it again, <laughs> different ways, you know. A crown for a king. That's right. And speaking of the man that said that, Cal Drogo. Ah man, Cal Drogo. A lot of people aren't gonna like this answer. Oh no, because. He started out elite. Yeah. But then but then he He's he's average. Damn. Damn. Everyone's gonna hate me. He was elite, right? For two episodes. For one episode. Well he wasn't elite at the very start because he was he was putting it on Daenerys without her wanting it. Yeah, but. exactly. <laughs> exactly. So but he was he, elite for realistically one episode worth of being elite. Now we have Khal Drogo's brother, <clears throat> who I don't remember his name. It, wait. He's for sure his brother. Whenever. Well, someone in the comment section um, said that he doesn't. They don't think that they're actual brothers. It's no. just the one the, the blood riders when they say mm -hmm. blood for blood or blood for my blood or blood of my blood or something like that. Yeah. Okay. So like all the blood riders, technically they're brothers by blood, but not actual brothers. Mm -hmm. And technically, when the cow dies, the blood riders are supposed to die. That's what someone said in the um. Needs to die. <laughs> well, he did. Yep. All right, and then the last one is the witch. Wait a second, you're gonna tell me they have him and not his other, his other brother, and the yeah. good one? Yeah, the nice one. Yeah, I would have put him in elite. He was pretty lit. He had the whip. Yeah, yeah I, liked I liked him a lot, him. bro. The way he went around the throat, Look, around the heels. What that is, man was Indiana Jones. We'll go ahead and say. I was just about to say. We'll go ahead and say this. Indiana Jones is getting elite. Yeah, he's elite. One hundred percent. Now you know that now. But the and also there was the two girls that were like the helpers of Daenerys. Yeah. Surprised none of those are on here. You put all these other characters on this tier list, but okay. Well, Stupid. the witch. Um, I can understand. You know, she she had told Khaleesi, um, she told Daenerys that she had already been raped before she so-called saved her, yeah. you know? So I, I kind of can understand what she's saying. Um, she needs to die. Let's go ahead and clean this up a little bit. Let's let's go from yeah, needs we'll do to this die quickly. up to elite. Okay, go ahead and put Joffrey at the end. Wait. So he's the least, the one that needs to die the least. No, he needs to die the most. We're, so he's basically, on the lowest end of the it, lowest like, end of of needs to die is the uh, most needs to uh, die and works to up bottom. to the best yeah. elite. Okay, right? I get it. I get it. Joffrey, and then put Cersei, um, the end of yep. Okay, and then go to oh, bro. Uh, all right, uh, Alistair. Mm -hmm. Alistair Moon goes directly after or directly before Cersei. Okay, and now, uh, blah, 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 what's her name of the veil? Mm -hmm. Lady Aaron. Lady Aaron goes directly before him. Okay, and then her son goes directly before her. Okay, and Ooh. then, um, who did we say looks like a silo of corn? <laughs> Viserys. Oh, Viserys <laughs> goes directly before him. <clears throat> um, okay, and then the Lannister boy. <laughs> Goes right before him. Okay. And then the witch. And then uh, Caldro goes. Yep. And then the two boys. Got it. Okay. Hate. All right. Hate. Um, I think that's a good order. Okay. Bad. Bad. I am going to put the the two Lannisters at the... Oh, wait. No, no. Right where they are. 
uh, actually put the little boy before the girl. Yep, because I don't really know anything mm-hmm. about him. Yeah. Um, and I honestly don't really know anything about her. But we're going with this order, okay? <laughs> Average. Um, Average. Uh, let's see here. Cal Drogo is going to go to the top of average. Okay. And then Cat. Oh shit. Okay. And then Varus. Then, oh, yep, there we go. And then, well, I can't think of his name. Renly? Nope, <laughs> left. Rickon? Rickon. Then Renly. What the shit? Rickon. And what? There we go. Um, and then both of the whores. <laughs> Redhead first. <laughs> and then the guy we know nothing about. <laughs> <laughs> and then Santa. And then Santa. <laughs> okay. Okay. Good. Bran. Yes. Then Theon. Okay. Oh, no. uh, yeah, yeah. And then King um, Baratheon. I would honestly keep those, yeah, just like that. Uh, is that Jamie? Yeah. Yeah, yeah then Jamie. Um, <clears throat> uh, I'm going to look Hold through on. here. Oh, okay. Put um, Tarly <clears throat> in front of Littlefinger. Yep, and then put um, Eamon directly after Tarly. Okay, and then put... Where's Hodor? He's in the lead. Oh, okay. Um, oh, oh, then put Filch. Filch. And then put... Um, well, I can't think of his name. We really like him. Got his finger ripped off. Da-da-da-da-da. Left. Yeah, left. Le- yeah. Right, right yeah. there. <clears throat> okay, and then um, Sansa and Bran's lady that talks to them a lot. <clears throat> That's on a spike now. Uh, Got a head on a pike. Okay, and then the Winterfell uh, Meister. Meister. Uh, far left of the bottom column. All right, and then the... Uh, and then Osha. Okay, and then John's two friends. And then um, Cat's protector. And then Jory. Oh, wait. Okay. Uh, what's his name? Very far end. Right here? Yeah. Barristan Selmy. Barristan Selmy, honestly, is going... I'm moving him. Okay. I just remembered the scene where he, like a badass, started ripping off his yeah. his clothes, and he was still going to fight him. He said, even now, I could cut through the five of you like cake. And they knew it, because yeah. they did not try him. He's going to elite. Okay. Sorry, guys. I just, uh, <laughs> I had a lapse of judgment there. Apparently, all this pee went to my brain. <laughs> the pee in my bladder, not the pee in my drink. That stuff goes straight to my belly, oh. which kind of then went to my bladder, which is now going to my brain. So, indirectly, it's going to my brain. It's a cycle. That's a right. Circle. P. Okay, and then, yeah, Jory, and then <clears throat> Littlefinger, and then, what's his name? Loris. Loris. Okay, up to Elite. Mm-hmm. Um, on the low end of Elite, I'm going to put... Oh, uh, leads Ari to... Yorn. The wall. Yorn. Okay. And then... Oh, man. <laughs> this one's harder. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. From here, I would put... It, it might be easier to start from the top. Honestly, I think so. So, uh, we've got a good order so far. Um, I would put Ned, then Rob. Actually, Ned, then John. <laughs> then Rob, then Ari, then Tyrion, okay. and then Lord Commander Mormont, okay. um, then Hodor, then Benjen, <laughs> then honestly the Hound. And I know the Mountain possibly is more elite than the Hound, but I'm just gonna put it in this order <laughs> because I want to. Okay. Then Jorah. Okay, then um okay, then ghost. Then summer. Then um 
Why can't I think of um, Ari's? Nymeria. Nymeria, yeah. Nymeria. And then... Who do we have left? We I have... see them. Uh, Lady, we have Lady, Grey, yeah. Wind, Grey Wind, and Shaggy Dog. Oh, and Shaggy Dog. Okay. Um, sh- Shaggy Dog. Now, now remember... Oh, oh no, never mind. That was Nymeria. I was about to say. Hey, I was about to say. Remember, night lady biting. Uh, yeah, no, Joffrey, no, no. But no, that was Nymeria. <clears throat> um, then Grey Wind, and then Lady. Oop. Okay, and then, um, why can't I think of his name right now? Which one? This one. Yep. Bron. Bron. Yeah, Bron. Okay. And then Daenerys. Okay. And then. Um, like I literally just forgot his name. Which one? Uh, I just moved him to elite. Oh, Barristan. Barristan. Okay. I'm gonna do Yorin first okay. because he saved Arya's life. Okay. Arya's life. She could have been captured by um by Joffrey's men. Yeah. And he saved her life, and then um she was just kind of saved from some bullies, yeah. you know. But she could have held her own too. Yeah. Oh, she was with that sword. That's right. Needle. Needle. Well. So there we go. There it is, guys. There's the full tier list sitting there. Yep. At the bottom, if you forgot, it says needs to die. You can't see it. Oh, yeah. Let me control minus real quick. Needs to die. Uh, There it is. Oh, yeah. Joffrey was at the bottom. We didn't even see him for a sec. Yep. (laughs) Good. Honestly, you know what? (laughs) Forget him. (laughs) Well, doesn't even deserve to be on this list. Oh, that was fun. Yeah, yeah, I had a lot of fun doing that, and we recorded for two hours. Yeah. Oh my dear lord. One hour and thirty-seven. But if you guys enjoyed this and you would like to see us do this for every season, let us know. If not, tell us to stop. <laughs> so I we're waiting till we get back. It's a bit unorthodox. We're doing this just kind of freestyle. That's right. Yeah. But this uh, is our first ever tier list on anything. Yeah. And we'll get better at it. Yeah. Um, if you liked the video, please like, comment, and subscribe. Yes. Um, if you hated the video, tell us why, and then we'll fix it on the next one. Maybe. Um, but it was nice sitting here talking with you, and even though I didn't really talk much. And you have a good day, and thank you for watching. Yes. Bye. <laughs>